Hello everyone, this is Saeed Akhtar Khan again. Today I will present you how to create a shapefile in QGIS. I already explained what is a shapefile and what sort of extensions it contains in my previous video. Here I have opens the area belonging to the delta of Indus River. So let's say if I want to create a shapefile for uh, let's say this particular area somewhere here yeah so what i need to do is there are two ways i need to click on layer then create layer and then new shape file layer or new temporary scratch layer so if i go for temporary scratch layer i can later export it export it as a shape file or I just go into new shape file layer so I need to select where I want to save let's say I want to save it as a river or interest maybe I already have a file but I will replace it with this one so and the geometry is polygon that's what all you need to do is and maybe yeah important one is to pick a coordinate reference system I pick this one 32643 UTM zone 43 and, and WGS 84 this is important yes I overwrite it okay so first I need to edit it so we need to click toggle editing we have a layer here now we need to click on this feature add polygon feature okay and once I click here now I can add vertices so let's say I begin from this point one okay if you see this one we have this one okay and let's say that's the end of the point we want to create okay so once you end you click the right button of your mouse you put OK if you have other features you can give it an ID so that's what you have created a share file so this way you could create a whole yeah the river body so once you have done it you just need to uncheck this toggle editing so once you uncheck this it will ask you to save yes we save it and your file is ready okay let's look how it is saved so here we see there are six different extensions I explained in previous video so this is the mainly the shape file but in order to read it in QGIS we need some other such as QPG which is the projection as well as the attribute table is stored here and that's the encoding and this PRG is basically to read this file and edit this file in ArcGIS. That's it for today. Please let me know your feedback. If you like it, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.